What is going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more scrap mechanics. So, um, okay, this episode is being recorded shortly after the uh last episode, and I figured out this. I, fi I figured out the hydro cannon. So, uh, I kind of built this little frame right here, and actually, this this is gonna become the thing of itself. But essentially, what you have to do is you don't have to pipe it to it. You have to put a button. You, you want to use a button. You don't want to use a switch. You mark the button to that and then you have to say oh i want this to use that resource and it just magically goes so now as you can see we hit a button it waters things um now it only does a, like a two by two area so it's gonna have to get moved around so um i actually put a bearing under there and we're gonna see if i can mess with that but i was like messing with stuff and i was just like okay you know what i wonder this it allowed me to build off of this so you guys know you know exactly what i'm about to say don't you you know exactly what's about to happen we put this guy down right here guess what we now have a base that's off the ground and these aren't destructible so in theory we could put a floor on this move all of our stuff up here and it should be safe from the robots it should and if we want to do one up we could build it out and then have another level on the top actually you know what now i'm curious to see how high does this thing actually go? Like if I wanted to like actually get up here, am I able to do that with this? How high does this thing go? Let's see. Okay, so this is max height. Okay, so we'd have to have a platform, but um, I, this is also something like this is beta. I don't know if this is gonna be fixed because of this kind of, yeah, you know, in, in, uh, you could do this and have your farm up there. And then in theory, the robots wouldn't be able to get it. Maybe, I don't know. I'm sure there's something I'm missing. Uh, maybe these these guys have some reach. Maybe he's gonna be able to get up here and he's gonna be able to hit these Maybe I should have put this up a little bit higher, but in theory it should work. It should work So we are gonna work on getting a base. We're gonna move our base up here I'm gonna do it I mean if they patch it if something happens with it, you know, like whatever it is what it is But um, it's not gonna take very long. It's not gonna take that many resources to do all we do is got to put a frame up uh, and then put a floor on it so i'm actually gonna go ahead i'm gonna pop these off because i think i do want to pop the frame up a little bit higher just to be safe uh and then we're gonna go ahead we're just gonna remove all of this and we're gonna oh my gosh i'm super excited about this i'm super excited anyways thank you guys so much for the support on the videos it's been absolutely amazing you guys are absolutely awesome seems like you're enjoying it so uh we're gonna move this guy up a little bit higher and I think we would be safe. This is like, I think this, could this become the ultimate base? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But uh, yes, again, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Thank you guys for the support. Let's go ahead. Let's get these all removed and we'll have ourselves a, we'll put, we'll put up a new frame in no time at all. Uh, yep. See there it fell. All right. So the floor, <laughs> the floor is going on nicely. Now, uh, what I did was I actually put in a couple things going into these pillars because like, I'm just like, <sighs> what are the odds that this is going to come crashing down like when it reloads in or something so i went ahead and actually this guy's at max height for this so now we can just boop, pop out and look at that so uh yeah as you can see like i kind of went through i tried to like reinforce it around these pillars as much as i could um i actually did one here and one here going from the ceiling too but i don't know that those are actually going to be uh doing a whole lot so i'm just trying to get the floor uh finished up here and let's see, do we have more wood blocks? Okay, so I took my barriers down over there because I'm like, well, in all actuality, we're not really going to need those barriers. Not good. We're just we're just not gonna need them. So uh, let's see if we can get this finished out with stone here. Oh, it's close. It's so close. Um, okay, hold on. We have a few of these things. Let me see if I can use some of these as a floor. I mean, it looks like I can. Why not? And then you know what? Let's just throw um I have some of this mesh stuff too. Let's just throw these in here. Like that. We should be able to walk on this, no problemo. And that in theory should keep us safe from the stuff. I think if this works, if it continues working, I'm hoping. I'm really hoping that it continues to work. Uh and I'm hoping it doesn't like get patched or something. They're like, oh well, that's a cheat. So uh <laughs> but uh this will be good. Now the next thing is like, okay, could you use this for a farm? Like, can I put my farm up there? And I don't know because uh, the thing with the crops is that they have to be within sunlight. So that means they can't be completely covered. Are you guys done yet? No, not yet. Okay. Um, so yeah, those can't be completely covered, but we can now move some stuff up here. Let's go ahead. Let's grab, uh, let's grab our crafting stuff. And ooh, we should be able to move our vehicle up there too. We should be able to, but we should also be able to do all the crafting stuff. Uh, over here as well so i should be able to hop on that thing lift up and then 
Uh, I'm sure later on we can actually probably make ourselves some kind of lift for this. All right, and then up. Oh my gosh, it's working. I can't even believe this. I can't even believe this. <laughs> I love it. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and put this guy down right there. And then that looks great. Guys, we have carrots. We have carrots for the first time ever. This is amazing. Okay, these are gonna take a little bit to get watered. Oh, we have carrots. This is, <laughs> that's the first food I think I've ever grown here. How many carrots do we make? We made four of them. It's a fantastic moment. All right. Um, I'm trying to get my stuff all moved over here to this base. Now, this is either going to work amazingly well or it's going to fail horribly. Um, I'm hoping for the uh, working amazingly well. But I, like I said, I'm planning for it to fail terribly. All right, so we can have our vehicle up there. I got it up there from here, but that takes our lift and our only way up to uh, our base currently. So <laughs> uh, refinement needed, but I think that's going to be primarily for a nighttime thing because I think the robots come at night to actually get you. So um, I should be able to pop that guy off and then uh, lift creation. And I should be able to go ahead and, uh, whoop, hello. Rotate this guy uh, like right here. For now, we could always, uh, we could always build a garage or something, but you know, I don't know. <gasps> yes, look at that. We did the things, we grew some carrots. Okay, now can I eat the carrots? because I need food. I need food so bad. Please give me more than the milk. Oh, yes, it does. Oh, it gives me so much food. We're not going to be starving all the time now. This is wonderful. All right. Um, So let's grab a thing of carrots. Actually, let's grab this one too. And let's plant some more carrots. Now, we need to go and find this guy, this trader, because the trader is going to allow us to um, do the things. Now, that's nine. I'm not planting any more than nine right now because I don't want to deal with that. Uh, but I do need to... We need to get a watering system online. How do I want to do this? So I do have some more of these little uh, awning things. I'm going to see if we can't put some out. I'd like to place them like right here. <gasps> yeah, can we walk on that? <laughs> we can indeed, yes. Yes. Uh, okay. Oh, that one looks better though. I like that one better. Hold on. Let's pop this one back off and let's put that one back on this way. Oh my gosh. This is great. And then this one is like a legit just awning. <laughs> We're just, I'm just, this is literally those places that we've just been scrapping. All those little shack towns. You can pretty much disassemble like all of them and uh, use them for all kinds of stuff. So that's how I'm getting all these walls and bears and things like that. So uh, let's see, do I have any more in here? I'm trying to gather, I'm trying to gather all the stuff that I just have laying on the ground because now we have storage to put it in. Before I didn't have storage, so now I do, and now I should be able to like, you know, store the things. Oh, look at this. We could even get another light in here if we need another light. Do we need another light? We might need one down below. Um, okay, hold on. Is there anything else that I can use up here? We could probably use this guy. Actually, we probably should use this uh, for some walls down here against these robotos. And then can we throw a light under here? <gasps> Ta-da! We have a light. <laughs> this is great. I love it. Okay, so. Uh, it's almost nighttime. We should be about good. Oh, these, all these are like music note deals. You know, one thing that I don't know that I did, I don't know if I slept since we got back here and I would hate to die and spawn all the way at the other base. So let's just go ahead and pop into here and uh, just do a little sleepy sleep. So our friend next door has respawned. Hello. What's up, dude? Hiya, 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 hacha. Yeah, you done, son. All right, perfect. Let's refine this. <laughs> And I think we're going to sit through the night. Um, I'm going to do some little building things here and there. But in the morning, we are going to go find that trader. We're going to go find it. it. It needs to happen. Ooh, actually, we need to water our plants. That's what we need to do right now. That has to happen. You know, I'm actually wondering if it's up higher, if it will actually splash a little bit more than uh, from before. Okay, so let's do that. You to there. You to there. Nope. Hey, you to there. And then... All right, let's see. How many do we water? All right, so we watered three. We should be able to get four. Uh Oh, we got it in a T pattern. Interesting. Let's keep going. So one water thing doesn't like cover a whole bunch. You have to shoot a lot, unfortunately. All right, it doesn't look like I'm going to get any better than that. So let's go ahead and move it over. Actually, what would happen if we just... Like, I wish there was a way to disperse the water a little bit, but you know what I mean? It's really hard to water these things. They are such a pain. What if we did that? Can we hook, can we connect this? I don't think this is considered 
No, I can't. I can't connect it like that. All right, how much water do you have left? You have 12? Oh, see, that watered right there. That's not where I need it. All right, so I got that one. <laughs> I literally just got that one. I need these two. Oh my gosh. I feel like to, get, to do this efficiently, you would have to have one of these over every single plant. If you wanted to be fully effective and hit one button and just water all of your crops all at once, that would be super expensive. Hey, oh, it's the cook pot up there. Okay. All right, we should be good still. I don't see any robots. Uh, we need a better way to water these things. You know, what if we built a seat? What if we drop down a seat and put this on two axes, front, back, side, to side, and then we could, I wonder if it would essentially let us drive it as like a vehicle. Like we'd be able to control different directions on those bearings. You know how like we sit on here, that would be one direction, aim the cannon, this would be another direction, aim the cannon, you know what I mean? Like boom, 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 boom. Just keep firing like this back and forth and then like up and down, maybe that way? I don't know. Hmm. Also, how much fuel do we even have left? Oh gosh, we only have one gas in there. Not good. You know, if we built one more hydro cannon and just centered it, because this one's doing these four, if we just centered it right here, it would knock out these four. So you could have one over every four if you centered them perfectly. Hmm. What does it take to make another hydro cannon or a water cannon? I keep calling it a hydro cannon. I don't know why I keep calling it a hydro cannon. All right, so interactive. If I wanted another water cannon, what do I need? Oh, I need some components. Ooh, that is not the worst thing ever to need because we can go out and get components. So I really like these mesh blocks. I was kind of looking at them I'm like, you know what? That'd be nice because we could see what's going on under, right underneath of us. But what do those guys take to make? Uh, it takes two and it makes 10. Net block, solid net block, punched steel block, and a solid net block. It makes 10. Zero flammable, what's the weight? Durability, friction, buoyancy. I'm, I'm wondering, can I build stuff on these if they're nets? I wouldn't see why not. And we could just put a couple of them in here. Oh wait, we could use glass. We could just use some glass blocks. That would work. Uh, sand. Wait, how do I not have any? Oh shoot, I used like all of the stone. Ooh, we're gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to do some resource collecting. Let's do, uh, let's craft two of those. And we're gonna make some glass blocks, but it is daytime. So inventory is relatively clear. I have five carrots. I should have, uh, I should go get some corn. I should go get some corn and get some milk. Let's, we gotta do that. Darn it, I should have done that last night. You know what? We could always do that on the way there though. We could, all right, let's do it, let's go. Uh, actually, hold on, I need to refill this with gas first. That's not what I wanted to do. Gas, please. All right, we'll throw five in there for now. Uh, we still have 20 in our inventory, so we should be good. Let's go ahead, let's do it. So I have a rough, I think I have an idea. I don't know. You know, I say I have an idea, I probably have no idea. But I have an idea of kind of what I'm looking for-ish when it comes to the trader. Now, I don't have a lot to trade, but I wanna, like I said, I wanna see what we need for, for, uh, for trading. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, we finally found it. I was so close the whole time. You can almost see my base from here. I was so close. It's literally right behind that first. Oh my gosh. I was so close. This is where the trader is at. Oh my gosh. I've been looking. We looked so hard for this guy. Okay, so drop off that. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? Drop these off. Press the button. They get sucked up. Okay. Oh, so we could bring him fruits instead. Is that what I'm saying? Is that what I'm hearing? Seeds, hideout, <gasps> mountable spud gun, a spud gun. Oh my gosh, this is exactly, wait, what is that? What does the cage thing mean? Wait, what? What is the cage? Spud gun, what? Hideout, so I can deliver things here and then I can choose what I want to buy. Oh man. Oh, I could have got a drill for five beats. Are you kidding me? And I could have got a blade for five tomatoes. I trade one carrot and I get five soil. No way. But how do I crate them up? How do I package them and deliver them? I feel like, oh, hey, what up, dude? It's the guy. Okay, but what is this? What is, okay, so how do I get a spud gun? Connect to an ammo container with a trigger and shoot. Spud gun with single potato shot. So this is what I, I'm looking, oh my gosh, spud shotgun? Shoot sizzling hot fries in a spread. Oh man, how do, okay, so what is this cage though? And a spud gatter. <gasps> oh man. Orange, blueberries, 
bananas oh we this is like our place this is the place potato ammo container i think i have one of these maybe i don't maybe i don't maybe i can just make it oh my gosh farming is the way because look at all the stuff we can get the soil that's kind of crazy and then there's also uh garment boxes and stuff now i don't know what that is i don't know what I don't know what this this guy is. What is it? It looks like a person. It looks like a person in a cage. Does does it not? It looks like a person in a cage. I have I have no idea. So okay, so we use that. That's gonna suck up whatever I put underneath of it. So how do I package the stuff? A crate. Interesting. All right, this is super cool. So this is the guy that I was looking for. So we need. Oh man, we just gotta get farming. We need to, we need to just start rock and roll with the farm and stuff. Um, oh, I can't just, I can't just, wait, can I, can I have these? Are these for free? Yeah. Thanks, man. Oh, this is super cool. Okay. I don't, I don't know how to make this though. So I'm gonna have to look into my, uh, my inventory stuff because I think we also have to do the same thing unless, hold on. You know what? Actually, let's go look at something else too real quick. Oh, free crates. You shouldn't have. I'll take these hands down. I need component kits is what I need. I need lots of component kits right now. Yes, we got some component kits and some soil. Winning, winning. All right. Uh, I want to see what this guy does because, oh shoot, we can't let that guy hit us. He will do damage. All right, so this. Okay, so we need a chest with a vacuum pump pushing and then it gives us packaged fruit so we have to come here first package the stuff and then go trade it with the guy guys we need a name for the guy okay so i can package oh this is why there's multiples i can package tomatoes beets broccoli and carrots here now does that change dependent upon what it is or does that change oh yeah see all those containers up there or is that why there's multiple packing stations for multiple different things well this one says like you package all those Hmm. I'm curious because there's eight items in total and we only have four here. All right. Well, we got to figure some things out. So I need a chest with a vacuum pump on it to back up to that guy in order to package anything. But we need to get some. We got to get some farming actually happening here. That's the problem. We don't have enough farming actually going on. All right. How are these guys doing? They're doing they're they're doing good. All right. So we've decided that we need one more hydro cannon in order to be watering those uh, those eight plots. Now, can I finagle this? Oh, I can't get close enough, can I? Maybe if I maybe if I pop it right here. All right, can I get you now? Ah, I had it, darn it, and I fell off the edge. All right, and we're gonna lift it. We're gonna put it right here, and we're just gonna take it out. Boom, and can just chill there. It's good to go, uh, because we only really need that for when we're out doing stuff like that. And I think right now, I don't think we're, I think we're good. I don't think we need anything. You need to stop it with the sounds. That thing is loud. <laughs> But I already have a vacuum pump, so that's good. Now, okay, okay. What, what did we need for uh, one of these guys? Hydro cannon, two component parts. Did I get two? I think I only got one. Yeah, I only got one. Okay. So I need to go out. I need to get some component parts, and then I need to store some stuff. I need to store the seeds that I'm not using. Um, I think we need to get rid of uh, some of these things. I don't know if there's a way for us to scrap them. Yeah, I have no idea. And actually. I don't really want the vacuum pump on me either. Let's go ahead and take two of those out. Let's throw the vacuum pump in there. Um, all right. I'll throw some embers in here because we are running a little bit low in that chest on embers. All right. So I need a component kit so we can make one more hydro kit. Oh, it's already grown. Those things grow super fast. Look at that. They grow super fast. Oh my gosh. We have eight. We could actually, we might actually be able to try to package these things up. All right. So what did I need? Oh shoot. I don't remember what I needed. What did I need from that guy? You know what else I'm thinking? I'm thinking that the numbers, it says like one carrot and one of that are like two beets. I'm thinking that's two packaged beets. So that means you probably have to have two um, things of eight because I'm guessing it's probably eight in a package, maybe more. I don't know for sure. Uh, where's the spike? Where's that? Okay, it's right here. So uh, since we're getting close on the carrots, let's just go ahead and get those going. Uh, one more. Uh, ooh, I'm probably out of water. Yeah, I'm out of water. Okay, we're good. There we go. Would you water that one? There. Okay, we got it. <laughs> we're good. Uh, okay, so we need another hydro cannon for this one. And if we're only farming at eight, we don't really have to worry about waves yet. So that allows us to get more things built up and things like that. So, um, and these guys actually don't take very long to to like grow either. So it's kind of, it's kind of nice. So I'm getting ideas as I'm sitting here. 
and I'm thinking, okay, what would be the best way to water our plants, right? Multiple hydro or multiple water cannons. Well, you know, I was kind of thinking about something and I don't know, seat one, driver, saddle, and a saddle. Use the word standing. This one. Oh, level five, driver, saddle, unlock steering settings by pressing E and connecting bearings with connected tool. What? Oh, anyways, okay. Um, we'll probably use the scrap one, but what if instead of just having them hard mounted, this is probably something for the future. We actually set up a rail system that essentially would be connected, but it'd be on a beam. And then we put three wheels, one on each side, one on the top sides and sides and a seat with this and a water tank connected to it. And then we could water and we could actually move down and water our crops. I don't know. I don't know that that would work. Um, it might, it might, it might be a little bit over my head though, but I think, I think ideally, I mean, we could put it like we could center the seat if we wanted to, and then have maybe even have like a wheel or two going up, pressing up against the bottom of this and then another, or we could just have one. But it had to be balanced though, wouldn't it? Because it would want to lean. Hmm. I don't know. That might be a little advanced for me right now. <laughs> that might be a little advanced for us. Who am I kidding? That's way advanced for us right now. Uh, is this guy done? <gasps> Yay! It's done. Okay, cool. So let's see. Let's let's get more carrots. I'm just growing carrots right now because it's it's working. And um, it's working. It's working. That's what it's doing. Okay. So that's good. I need to go out and get more component kits though, because I think we are just going to stick for now with another hydro cannon. Uh, we're just going to place it right here. So we get these four. Uh, we can do crops of eight at a time. And they, like I said, they grow pretty fast. So it's not that big of a deal. And then uh, if we want to get fancy, we could hook those up and maybe have them move back and forth or something. You know, I, I don't know. I don't know. But I'm waiting for it to be morning. It's super close because I want to go check out this building right here. I don't think we've gone through this one um, because I need component kits. So I need to go through some chests or kill some robots or something. All right, let's go check out this place right here. Let's see. Um, I'm sure we're going to run into some robots. I'm going to grab corn if we go past it, though, because now that I have a food source and I'm and I'm finally not. So I'm sorry. I had to listen. Um, I'm scared of the big red guys. The big red dudes are a pain. Oh, he hit us. What a jerk. All right, where are you at? Is he up there? Um, uh, where's that guy at? Oh, he's right there. Well, there's one right here. Uh-uh. Not today, son. Oh, shoot. There's two. I just took out your friend. You don't want to do this to yourself. Oh, man. One hit and I'm dead. Okay. I need to just run away. If we come across any more, I just need to run away. Circuit boards. No, I need component kits. Oh, you know what? I bet he's in here. Is he a crate? I bet he's in here. He's not in here. Interesting. Components? Uh, no components. Okay. All right, let's go running out. I like to run out first to make sure that I'm not like walk oh, like that to walking right around a corner and being attacked. All right, component ah, circuit boards. What is the deal? Hey, component kit. Good. I hear you up there. I hear you up there. Ooh, bag of swole, circuit breaker, some uh, some more seeds. Where are you at? You're here somewhere. Maybe they're up there. Okay. Ooh, component kit. Yes, please. Some gasoline. I like it. <gasps> More component kits. Yeah. And some fertilizer. Oh, heck yeah. We're getting all the good stuff. All right. So this is like similar to the building that I did, be uh, I did before. I literally ran up here and there was like four of them. So I've got to be careful. I wish the sound would work. Like you could hit something and draw one of them out. I'm right here. Hey. Okay. Yep. Saw me. Oh, shoot. All right. We're fine. All right. I don't know how I managed to pull that off without getting hit. Oh, I thought I heard somebody else walking around. I thought he was going to drop from the top. It's like, it's like a secret ninja kill. <laughs> Stupid. Hey, bot. it's a ninja bot. Oh, there you are. Hello, dude. What's up, man? Yeah, come on. Let's do this. Me and you, bud. Any more? Okay, let's grab this guy. Uh, yes, component kits. That is what we needed. I feel like there's gotta be one more. No? All right. Uh, a little bit of water. Oh shoot, we're full on stuff now. We didn't even get to the top where the good stuff's at. Hey, there's a chest hidden under the stuff. Ooh, another thing of soil, some chemicals, anything under here. 
No, okay. All right, this building is super tall. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and drink something real quick. Our water is a little low. Oh, I love having actual food. It's so nice. Anybody up here? I actually don't hear anything. <gasps> An orange and a bearing. Those are amazing. Uh, let's consume this sh shake. We'll grab the orange and then let's drop. Oh gosh, let's drop this cash register. Those things are like literally everywhere. I'm not seeing anybody. <gasps> oh, a good crate. Yellow ones are always good. Component, four component kits, six gas, some circuit boards. Absolutely. Oh, we're gonna have all the component kits in the world. More component kits. Uh, that's what we're here for. So we have to get more component kits. Uh, pipe. No, I don't need that. Actually, yeah, you know what? We'll drop the water next time because I don't need water. We can get that super easy. <gasps> yes, component kits and glass. Mmm, glass is not hard. We'll replace, we'll replace the corn with it. All right, I think that was it. I think we hit. Oh nope, there is one more level, and it just had a tomato in it. Okay, I think that's it for here. It looks like it. Oh man. All right. So how many component kits did we get in total? We forgot two ten. We got twelve component kits from this one factory. That is a successful run, my friends. All right, we should be good to make our second hydro cannon. Let's see, component kit, component kit. All right, so what else do we need? Interactive, hydro cannon. Boom, baby, we can make it, and we should be able to water a whole bunch of goodies. Uh, oh, did we ever make our second a water container? We probably didn't, did we? I don't think we did. I should have made the second water container. Darn it. Hey, hey! What are you doing? You were coming after my stuff. Don't lie to me. I know you were, you haybot. Yeah, get out of here. You know what? It's actually kind of good to have those cows out and about because I think they target the cows before they target my base. <laughs> That's super nice if it does. Cows, the best offense. All right, let's see. Um, did you knock down any walls? I don't think so. Looks like we still have three in here. I had five in there. A couple of them got out. It's fine. And we should have a hydro cannon in here. Very nice. All right, let's get this guy hooked up now. So let's see, we place that guy right here. So we need to place this one right here. Uh, let's rotate it so it's the same orientation. No, shoot, I had it. Perfect. All right, and then we should be able to, can we have multiples going to this too? And then this button also affects that. <gasps> Wonderful. And then fill that with a little bit of water. We should be able to hit the button and water these at the same time. We only got one out of that. There, oh, we missed it by one. <laughs> All right, let's, Um, we need to make, we need to make another water container so we have water being made over here like constantly because water's not like super close by for us, unfortunately. Oh, jeez. oh gosh, no, 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 no. You snuck attack me, that's not fair, that's not fair. That's not fair. Oh, one hit. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That guy got me good. Stop moving. Oh my God. <laughs> he had me pinned up against a rock. I was literally between a rock and a hard place right now. That's that's exactly what happened. Oh, I'm just over here trying to get some, trying to get some wax, some beeswax so I can make another container to throw it on our amazing island over there. You know, part of me really just wants to build our farm out there because it's surrounded by water. Gosh, you know, that would make sense. I don't think the bots could even get out there even if they wanted to. Maybe they can though. Maybe they can swim. I don't know. Further testing required. Wait, 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 wait. I only got nine out of those. Oh no, I needed one more. I needed one singular beeswax. Oh, I thought I had plenty. I thought I had a stack already. Mmm, darn it. All right, there. 10 more beeswax. All right, interactive. This guy. Yes, craft it. Make it happen. Uh, also, did we get any other things? I thought we, yeah, we got some more electronics. Did I get another component kit anywhere? I don't think so. Nope, let's not have. Okay, cool. So it's making that guy wonderful, wonderful. And you know what? Actually, since that's making that, there's no point in waiting on it. Let's just go ahead and let's just grab this guy. And uh, we'll go replace this one on our little island over here. All right. One container, connect it up right there, and turn that bad boy on, and guess what? We have water 
Flowing in, ready to go. Okay, cool. So the other one should be done. Actually, you know what? Uh, I'm going to stay here for a minute and let it collect up the stuff. And then we're going to go back. We're going to throw the other one in. We're going to get it all hooked up. And we should be good to go. Watering, well, eight plants right now, currently. I feel like two hydro cannons. I feel like one hydro cannon should be able to water like a pretty decent area. It'd be kind of cool if there was like a sprinkler attachment you could put on it. That would make it like shoot out like different directions instead of just like one gigantic ball of water. But, you know, I, I get it. It is what it is. Oh, darn. I just realized I don't have enough room for all this water. Mm, okay, I guess we're going to take uh, we're going to take two of them because I can't hold any more. <laughs> Do I have something that I don't need anymore? Mm, we could just eat the orange. We might as well. There's nothing else we can do with it right now anyways. And let's just go ahead and eat the tomatoes, too. Perfect. Okay, so one and two. That's 80. Okay, cool. So we'll let this do its thing and uh, we'll go back. We'll hook this up with the other container and get it all watered up. Oh, this thing is still not even done. Maybe it only does it while you're here. No, it doesn't because the other thing fills up with water while I'm gone. This should not have taken that long to make. What's the time say on this thing? I said a minute. I mean, that means it's a hundred. I don't know. All right. Anyways, this guy's about done. We're going to go ahead. We're going to get connected up. Oh, shoot. I don't have. Oh, wait, do I have another component kit? Oh, let's throw that in there. Wonderful. Um, and then, oh, that's right. This is working now. Put that in there. Like I so. And then bring this guy down. Bring it down. All right. Put those there. Use it. Let's go ahead and fill her up with the water. Now, keep in mind that the reason we went through, well, I mean, we're going to go through water pretty quick anyways. But initially, the reason why we went through uh, so much water so fast was because we were trying to figure things out and test everything. You know what I mean? So... Um, now we should be able to gather all of that. You know, part of me just wants to wait until they're all done. Then they'll sprout up at the same time. I mean, you know what? They're not going to, they're not going to do anything until they all get watered anyways. I do really wish there was a way to uh, pick up your soil that you planted. Um, it's kind of, it's kind of unfortunate. This guy didn't even plant. Uh, okay. Come on. Come on guys. Oh, I'm about to be attacked. What are you, where are you guys coming from? I've had like four of these dudes come to my base, like all of a sudden, like, I don't know what the heck happened. I just heard them like scurrying about. I think these cows are bringing them in. I think that's honestly what's happening. <laughs> are you guys done yet? Come on. You know, I really like how these things grow in like peanut shells. <laughs> they're like in a peanut shell. And then the carrot is like in the middle. Like when they're done growing, they like crack open. Come on, my dudes. I wanted to plant more. You know what? I don't even care. Let's just do it. Ta-da! All watered and good to go. <laughs> so the reason I kind of want to wait is because then I can water everything at the same time that actually needs water. Those guys didn't need water, but you know, we had to, we water them anyway. So um, now we do have fertilizer, but these carrots grow super fast anyway. So I'm not really worried about using fertilizer on carrots right now. And then um, I'm also curious on how the packaging is going to go because look at we have 10 carrots carrots stacked to 10. Um, so does that mean 10 carrots is a package or does that mean like, I have to have like 10 stacks of carrots? You know what I mean? I don't know. But um, yes, thank you guys so much for coming out. Hopefully you had a wonderful time. And uh, what do you guys think about the, the new base design? You think it's going to work? You think it's going to hold out? I don't know. I don't know. I'm feeling like it might get fixed somehow, some way. But um, yes, thank you guys for coming out. You have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next one.